Hey everybody, and welcome to Hexiled Gaming. I'm Scott, and I've got a match of X-Wing 2nd Edition for you here on Tabletop Simulator. This match between Starvald on the left and Ollie on the right. This is round six, the final round of Swiss in the Kyber Cup. Joining me, Deathrain, how you doing? Yes, I'm Deathrain. You are Deathrain, yes, and uh, let's make this all about you. What do you think about that deployment wow. in the top right corner? How do you feel about it? Uh, I'm going to write an angry Tumblr blog post, I suppose. <laughs> you heard <laughs> it here, folks. The blog is back on. The first new article, Oliver Pocknell is a filthy fortresser. Oliver is a filthy fortresser. Pass it on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Love it. Can't wait to read it. Hopefully it mentions me and my stream. Every single Facebook group he's affiliated with will just be have a picture of him <laughs> his fortress over. Here. <laughs> um, uh, I can be such a dick sometimes. Sometimes. Hmm. Star Vault on hey, the left, flying resistance. Uh, got a bit of a salad here. Kaz, Rose, Bastion, Nimi, and Merle. Love it. Loved. Uh, love some mixed composition. And look at that. Pose moving. What were you even afraid of? I think I spooked him. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so Ollie's got Ray and Poe. I like this. Five ships versus two. Nice variety. Even in the same faction. I mean, I mean from here, uh, Poe can still do a two-turn left and barrel back. To see where the, the other guy go. I'm I'm convinced he's under four, four straight for me there. <laughs> <laughs> he's listening. Confirmed. Um, so the, the most interesting thing for me is Kaz. We got why why you defender perform a primary attack. The enemy ship's initiative is higher than the number of damage cards you have. You may roll one additional die. So definitely the it's the best fireball. Um, has R five for repairing damage cards. Didn't do it turn one still has that possibility rose bastion nimi all naked and then an intimidation merle what what uh what score are these guys on that is a question and i will tell that you you right should now. know the answer to you yes Oliver. Uh, four and one. Uh, so whoever who wins, whoever wins this is guaranteed to make the cut. Is that right? Starvald's five and oh. Okay. So he's already oh, in. So he's got pared down, yeah. I'll go ahead and put that up here. I should have done that already. Rookie in the chat with the, uh, the details. He ever committed Poe because I went into the lobby and told him off the fortress and when he said he wasn't going to do it. <laughs> Rude boy. <laughs> Brendan in the chat. Imagine being pared down and your opponent is Ollie. Boy, no pressure. Imagine the, the game that decides if you make it the cut or not is by someone who's being pared down to you. I mean, imagine playing a very high-level game of X-Wing and you're not listening to the sultry tones of Oliver Pocknell. You're doing it over text? No way. Ray, one straight boost. I really do like that lone wolf token up there. Makes me want to... A lone wolf token that's just the Kojima logo? Or that... F uh, no, the Foxhound logo. Where is that thing? This one. Oh, that thing's so cool. Alright. 
Back to X-Wing. He is using Lone Wolf there, showing me the other side. Thank you. Fabian in the chat, how you doing? Ready to go stressed. Oh, did she... Did the boost. Oh, okay. You know, I didn't even look at Ollie's list. We got Old Poe. Yeah. Lone Wolf, R4, Overdrive, Advanced Proton Torpedoes. Ray with Rose Core. Finn, False Transponder, Stealth Device, and the Falcon title. Nice to see Stealth Device out there. We did have a shield upgrade Ray the other day. And yeah, I'm of the team that Stealth Device is better. Have you ever seen Stealth Device in the Venny? Oh, that was it was in that same match, yeah. It was Stealth Device Venny, Shield Upgrade oh. Ray. Cool. I think uh, a friend in the UK was flying a uh, uh, Venny of Stealth Device. Mm -hmm. I couldn't get over it because it's just the one agility ship. Yeah. I was like, no, no, you, you got like shot like 10 times in the match. You didn't lose a Stealth Device. I'm like, oh, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. The first time you come across a, a fully operational Vinny, that is a learning moment. Ah, going for those locks early. Love it. You do have jam on the other side of the table with false transponder codes. A little bump there from Nimi. Rose moves up, takes a focus. One hard and a bump from Kaz. Just getting in his opponent's head. Oops. Yeah, even if Bastion does a Hail Mary, four straight boosts. Uh, probably not getting hit from that. All right, man. It's these um, definitive statements. It's going to put a curse on him. I already did. It's your turn now. <laughs> Death Rain speaking in absolutes. One forward barrel roll. Only a Sith does that. Is he showing off his... Uh... Yeah, he did a decloak, so he's showing off the overdrive thruster. I'm ready for some spicy two-speed boosts or barrel rolls. Oh, Lou, let me know. He did use R5 on Kaz. Thank you very much. So Kaz is up to six hull. The Defender's Initiative is higher. So Kaz will get his ability until he's on one hull versus Ray, and he will always have it until he dies versus Poe, right? I think I got that right. Don't make me math. So he, he takes a damage card off, which means he can't shoot after the slamming. Yes, to, correct. Because he doesn't have a to, yeah yeah doesn't have a damage card to expose. So I mean, I, I guess what we're just doing here is just making sure that you have a cheap free dash shooter. Yep. I mean, he could slam for blocks, but maybe because he's lower initiative, he's not planning to slam and get shots. And also, I mean, he's afraid of Ray just eating him alive. All right. Ollie's ready to go. Now, also in the last Ray game, um, not with Ollie, uh, with another player we saw, Ray reached for a lock and ended up losing the false transponder codes early on. I don't think we'll see that from Ollie, but uh, definitely looking for a spicy use of those transponder codes. I mean, you can still lock a target 
and choose to take the token off and not their lock. Yes. Merle going up to the top of the board. Merle the flanker. Who'd have thought? Everybody else just kind of not fortressing. Don't you dare say it, Death Rain. Okay, right, where was he? I'm going to jump in that voice <laughs> chat now. They're just staying in a tight knit formation that doesn't move very far. There's a difference. Is, has anyone seen that episode of Peaky Blinders when they're all in the kitchen and he's telling the guys off? <laughs> they need to behave themselves on this wedding night. No fortressing. No fortressing. <laughs> <laughs> There's the one bank from Poe. Wow, look at that dial. Look at all the options he has. I haven't seen an overdrive dial like fully splayed out. That's intense. This goes for the normal barrel roll left. Definitely have to try on uh, Poe sometime. Because I had a lot of fun with uh, Venny. Yeah. Poe's got uh, access to the boost as well. You had him on Timon, right? The overdrive? Yeah. Yeah. Is this because like, you two, to f two, three, four speeds, you got three boost out of it? Yep. You had R4, so if you're stressed, you two turn and you get three boost. When you can focus, then you can do a two speed barrel roll. All right. Well. Second boost. Fidget spinner. <laughs> if you are Starvald here and you're seeing Ray just creep up behind you, what 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 do you do? Do you have to turn towards Ray this turn? Sure. I mean you you're not going to outspeed a large base ship with a boost. The thing is, if you turn in at this point, you might not have all four ships on Ray. You might just have maybe two of them. And Ray's going to love that if he does like a two bank in. You got to commit to somebody, right? And it feels like it's easier to nail down Ray of these two ships than it is to get Poe with double reposition. Overdrive thruster. Does he have black one? No. I mean, the main concern is a uh, core seller. Because Ray's can just go straight through that debris cloud. It's like, doesn't care. Yeah. There are six debris on the field. I just noticed that. That's yeah. not good for the distance now. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. Core interaction with debris is upsetting. Definitely an advantage for Ollie. Having Starvald bring debris as well. All right, double checking those dials. Chuck goes not by the way. Fortress is basically when you sit in the corner and you don't move for like half an hour. This ain't that. He's only like, only looks like he's fortress him because he bumped his own ship. He's waiting to figure out who he wants to actually go after. Merle's coming back in. I mean, if, yeah, he did bump him on purpose, didn't he? Um, but yeah, you don't know which way they're going to turn. Three bank from Nimi and a focus. Too hard from Bastion. One hard attempted. Oh. Rose. <sighs> All right. Uh, don't love this right now. <laughs> we'll see if Ray is uh, here to punish. 
Yeah, yes she is. Two bank in, relieves the stress. Are you in range of the back to Cam, uh, Kaz, Kaz and uh, Rose? Probably, yeah. I think so. I, at least Kaz. I mean, still, they're not modded. It's, uh, it's looking good for you. And Ollie, he's rubbing his hands together. Ooh, he's take licking the his chops. Off him. Oh, yeah. You could reach for the lock and jam that off. Yep. yep. Yeah. Yeah, choose the focus. No one's got mods now. Checking the intel that all three of those ships will be in range. Yes. There we go. Transponder, the world, man. World champion taking my, my uh, commentary <laughs> and helping him out here. Uh huh. Is he on the phone right now? Are you talking to him? <laughs> I'm texting him. <laughs> <laughs> he wouldn't have known to use his target lock without me telling him. Right? <laughs> That's exactly how the scenario is taking uh -huh. place in my head. Uh huh. <laughs> He'll send you the trophy in the mail. There's a four straight from Poe. Imagine if you <laughs> you had Ollie on Snapchat and <laughs> the only thing you're doing is like telling him how to play X Wing. <laughs> <laughs> and no, not that ship. Get the other one. Gonna check for a lock on Poe. Requires it on the debris. Overdrive. Two speed to the left. All right. Let's go. I'm worried about that barrel. I mean, uh, Bastion can do the hard three and have uh, Range and Pro coming in. Oh, then again, Bastion could probably just get initiative killed. Uh, no, Bast not this turn. I mean, next time. Okay. You use both of Ray's force points here. If you plan on sniping him with Poe later on, then yeah. Doesn't feel it. Leave it to... All right. He's going to get his lock right back with Rose. Two hits. Two natty evades, you bad man. Look at him. We were worried about Bastion. No way. Here's Kaz. 3v2. Trail mix. Ray, single evade. Fine for now. Rose. Range three has two rerolls on two dice. Yep. Pointing out the ships in arc, giving Rose the rerolls. One hit. Ray. Spins a force point. Oh boy. What was that sound? So sound? What? I don't know. I think somebody bought something in Stream Captain? But I don't even have Stream Captain open. <laughs> That's scary. Oh boy. It's fine. Oh, yes, yeah, stealth device. Yep, thank you, Tim. I praised the stealth device earlier, and then I forgot about it immediately. So, do you think Ray's going to sleep left? <sighs> I mean, with core, like, if you just go forward over the debris bump and shoot something at range one is that 
bad? I, I mean, I guess Merle and Nimi are coming in. So it's not like you're just fighting Bastion, Kaz, and Rose. You could end up having Kaz, Bastion, uh, go for Poe. And Rose is the one who gets stuck and just gets bought by Ray. Veteran says, Sloop left is madness, which makes me like it even more. Sloop left, Ray. Let's do it. Yeah, you definitely got to bring Poe in and shoot something with two shots to mostly double modded shots. It would suck to turn off stealth device with this loop. Yeah, man, go over that debris and roll the crit. <laughs> That's, the, no, that's against the rules, so Yoli has to make the cut first, and then get taken out of the first round. Oh, I see what that notification was. Brian, a new patron. Thank you very much. Welcome aboard. Ooh. Okay. Two bank left and you can boost. That seems fraught. My only issue with that is uh, Poe's kind of being left on his own. He's a lone wolf. He's used to it. So Merle's ability... Lowering your agility, while a friendly ship at range 0 to 2 performs a primary attack, if you are in the defender's bullseye. Okay, well, that's not going to happen anytime soon. <laughs> I like this flank and Merle, though. Hey, hey, Poe, take me seriously. You watch Poe po doing it too hard with the... Uh... Amazing yeah. play. That's one of the reasons I generally want to stay back and widen out my arc. Because, yeah, like you are saying, you can definitely um, dodge that with the right maneuver. I mean, straight boost would have been nicer, but at the same time, he's not he's not committing all his forces over, over this way, so it's no biggie. Man, Starvault, he has no problem bumping his ships back here. Oh my god, they're fortressing. <laughs> Now, he does a three bank, but he can boost while stressed. Rolls the hit. Boost right. Will be double stressed, but you can relieve you that with core. Available if you need it. Yep. What do you? Do you do like a, a sleep here? Next turn? Could. Yeah, yeah. You're, you're not at the maximum. They're not in a great spot to, uh, oh, to come up either. I was so sure yeah. this wasn't happening. I thought Poe was coming that's, in. That's hard too. Honestly, this gives him, now that I see it, uh, he could have focused and then done the overdrive boost left if nobody had come after him. Or, like he's doing here, roll right, arc dodge, super shot here on Merle. I mean, he's got his cause eye on. Oh, he did the roll, then the focus, so he didn't have to do the uh, two speed. Here come the APT. His lock is on the, uh, the debris still.
Did Ray go over the debris? Yep. That's why she's double stressed. One of the reasons. All right. 4v3. Uh, Lone Wolf is available. Spends it for the blank. Uh-oh. That was a crit. Why is it why is it two crits? Um, oh, because he got the yeah. Uh... He hit, one of his dice knocked the other one. It was hit crit. Eyeball. He rerolled a blank into a crit, so it's hit hit crit crit. But Merle uh, just takes one crit anyway. Stunned. Uh, can Merle stop the two turn from Poe next turn? Maybe yeah. we could do like a one hard, right? Mm hmm. I mean, now that you got half points on Merle, are you doing the classic ace play and just like getting out of here? Because. I mean, this whole resistance formation from Star Vault can just turn left. Or, yeah, ship left and come towards Poe. It can, but Bastion's going to be stressed. Uh, Rose and Bastion aren't aligned, so they're going to bump into each other. So is Kaz if he's not too careful. If he, that doesn't make any sense. If he's not careful enough, he's going to bump. Yes. I right. know English. Do you just two bank with Ray and you can sloop? Yes. Would you just two bank and shoot out the back to give yourself the option of boosting away? Is there anything you're worried about? Mm -hmm. I mean, I think it's game at this point, but uh, I don't know. <laughs> Someone hooked me up with that Lone Wolf token IRL. It, yeah, if you guys want it, maybe we can entertain that as a possibility in the future, because now that I see it, I want one. That is a dope charge. Lone Dog, though. <laughs> Not what you said. I think I'm going to make my own, make it into a pug. Ooh, I like that. That'll really uh, infuriate the candid clarinetist. He's throwing his, um, somebody had his corgi emotes in the chat, and I, I called it a pug. It'll never <laughs> be the same. It's almost right. impossible to memorize everything in the game at this point. Hey Lloyd, do you when you play on a game, do you read all the cards on the other side of the table? <laughs> or do we just go, nah, screw it, I'll just we just move and shoot, right? No way. Paul's got the bugs. A... I mean <laughs> the other ones, the corgis. The problem is th there's there's Scout in the chat whose name is Pugs. And that's what it, it's screwing me up. Sad corgis. Oh. Yeah, they've got the uh, the best emotes over there. Uh, so yeah, Merle, oh, you can. Sorry to interrupt. The pog champ is back, but it's uh, a different picture. It, yeah, they've been cycling through different ones. Oh boy. Ah, oh, we should do a pog chump. Who's going to be that face? You. Fuck. 
So <laughs> in before Scott says it's me. Merle <laughs> Merle can go for the block on Poe, or you could try and stay close to Poe and rotate your turret out the back. Uh seems like he's probably just gonna run with Poe. Now that you got your 18 points, game is over. I don't think, I think he's one. I'll take the kill here. I think the A win would uh, one hard and go back. Sorry, no, just, just generally one, one hard. Uh, I think one hard and you one bank around the corner. With Merle? Although you wouldn't, would Poe do one bank left? I don't think it would. Because you are stressed with Merle, so you'd have to do a two speed maneuver to get rid of the stress. Yeah, but you're not going to get rid of it. He's just going to try and stall Poe. Not getting rid of the stress. Focus rotate, probably. <laughs> All of a sudden, I like your idea better, Scott. Ooh. And yeah, the, oh, he does take that crit. It's just a shield on Bastion, but it's the emotional toll that's devastating. Rolling a crit on a debris, it just feels like a personal affront. That's like the game saying something about your mom. Has definitely been under a rock for you. Bitch, we've all been under a rock for a year. Where have you, where have you been? <laughs> what did I miss? I, I must have done something. Something silly. Mm, yeah. Don't get involved. This is, a, <laughs> this is a personal dispute between myself and Hedgehog. There's the two bank from Ray. Uh, doesn't have anything in arc. Could go, f could move the lock. Oh, rotating. Oh, he's rotating. The rarely seen rotate from Ray. Three straight from Poe. If you do a stressful maneuver with your boost, it's going to be a two bank left and actually cleared. Yep. So what do you do, like take a lock on something? You could lock, you could focus. Locking the Kaz, he says. <laughs> Veteran instincts. I was trying not to go there. The Ray Tate. No, no, no. It's low hanging fruit. There's the boost. <laughs> All right, into Bastion from Ray. Three dice, force points, target lock. Now I know what that sound is. Thank you, Powell, for the uh, the new patron sub. Two evades and an eyeball. Oh, and that's the one that went over the debris, so it doesn't have any tokens. Takes another one on the shield. Does the boost have to be the two boost? Only if it's red. One hit. Oh, we do have a shot in the bow. It's one hit, one evade. Now, Death Rain, you're a man who, at least today, likes flying two ship lists. What do you think of this resistance list? I mean, there's, it's not quite supernatural, Luke, but there's a lot of places you can be with it. Yeah, it does the job. <laughs> got double action. You've got different types of boosts and barrels available to you. Yep. R4 clears the stress each turn. Your I6. 
Uh, like to like. How many points is Poe? 82. Not quite 111. No, but not I mean, quite the versatility. Or I like the points. choice of advanced torps on there. Yeah. Because the, the two boosts can get you quite far, and if you're a bit too far out, you're just like, I'm going to sneak in and just throw five dice. He had but the I chance to do that on uh, on Merle, but opted not no, to. No, he didn't have lock. His lock well, was under three. He can take two actions, so he could have locked and barrel rolled. He could have barrel rolled and then locked. But he took a focus. You want to, you want to double modded. Well, it's like the Prockets thing, isn't it? You don't want to spend... You don't want to fire it until you have both mods. Yeah, and I guess especially since uh, against a three dice, three of eight chip... Did he, f did he put a lock on something? Poe? Yeah. Oh, yeah, he's, he's got, got it on cows. Okay. Yeah. So, I mean, from here, depending on where cows goes, you could do a two turn, uh, do the linked focus into a red barrel roll and be lined up to be a range one shot and then just like throw five dice in. Yeah, I love it. Then he takes a lock. I don't think he will do that because Kaz is just going to turn him. So is Rose. Is Rose moved yet? Oh boy. Oh, yeah, you really want it, don't you? I'd happily take the stress next turn you just two turn and focus and blast it out of the sky. Is the too hard from Ray? Can still rotate the turret with the uh, title. gonna rotate so double stress for now again Corsella will be able to alleviate all of that three straight from Poe uh, yeah boost yeah barrel left and then boost out again safe Oh man, he's just having his way with this list. Ray? There's an obstructed shot into Kaz or an unobstructed shot into Rose. I'm gonna shoot into Rose. It's a better shot. Rose will get rerolls on defense. Here's the Finn Blank, spins it for a lock. And the Force Point for hit at crit. Rose. One evade. Gonna get the reroll. Two evades. Takes it on the shield. Yeah, he's thinking about you have to be in the other guy's arc or not. Yeah. There's so much region in this game. There is. It's healthy. <laughs> I it's mean, good for you. The world champion does not read his cards. Just putting that out there. <laughs> he's got to watch his back and go, I hate this guy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, back to dials. Um, I'm just pointing out that we're not. No, we don't want to read the cards because there was so much text on these things. Now it's just impossible to remember everything.
Where are you going with Ray? I don't know, I'm not playing. Hard uh, three from Nimi. Bank in with Rose. Oh, Bastion is behind Rose and Kaz, and Bastion moves first. Oh, man. Ollie has just got this list all turned around. There's different initiatives. The lower initiatives are moving first. They're just going to bump. Poe is uh, free to uh, finish Murdoch, I think. Yeah. Where he's just been distracting them. And is there anything Merle can eat too hard right and like try and get this debris between him and Poe? Uh, yeah, I think he could do that. I'm still getting shot though. Yeah, I don't think there's anything you can do about that. Yeah, you can't stop it too hard from Poe. And he'll, he has plenty of repositions to move him to exactly where he needs to be. And the other four ships aren't really in a good spot that you can engage over there. You have to engage right. Does Ray just do a one forward and just sit there? Let them come in a little bit closer and then next turn you're free to do slips or whatnot. Could do. Is it? I mean, it's a bit of a risk, isn't it? But then again, you're double stressed and if you turn, you don't have your bonuses. So. trying to draw a Merle path out of here and it's not great. I was trying to do a five forward barrel roll boost. But yeah, I think you get the hard three from Nimi. That's easy. Hey, boy. Bastion. I mean, he's just going to bump into the back of Rose. Rose banks in. Gets in the way of Kaz. I mean, Mel can do the free bank to the right, boost to the left, and then barrel roll. Get you a bit closer. Coming down to 30. Ray's never walking in those jaws. I mean... You don't really have any more options. You, you kind of spent on your maneuverability, your dodging stuff right now. I think it's best if you de-stress, take the hit, throw something back, and then, and then bounce out. Squiggle about a bit more. Because well, because Ray Ollie's out now. He, he's uh, he's got himself in a nice spot where he can say, "Well, okay, I've taken off." Uh, one of the ships before I actually have to engage and start taking damage. Mm -hmm. Then after this round, it'll be like a reset where he can, he's free to run away again. Okay, Bastion K turns rather than bumping into the backs of Rose and Kaz. Seems good. Too hard. Rose does not care about... Oh, boy. Yeah, he's just... <laughs> he is all out of position. 
There's the two hard with Ray. There's only double stress, so. I mean, has the just can't available. Dunk. Yeah, is that a Kaz's arc? Oh, yeah. I mean, he can double down on Mo if she turns around. Is triple stress now, so you, you do have to relieve that next turn. I thought we have had to. Uh, I thought we had like four stress or something now. We just took one off. Poe opens up those wings. Mel hasn't moved, by the way. Yeah, he did. Yeah? Two straight. Oh. That's why he's got his focus. Oh. Uh. Yeah, that's a weird place to be. Uh, did do the hard two. Sorry, chat. I didn't know she could boost. I thought you, you were stuck there. Now, with the, with the title, <laughs> you can boost, rotate, and sloop while stressed, right? Yeah. Focus and lock. Actually, mm. now, Poe has Merle in the bullseye. If you are in the defender's bullseye, which Merle is, so Rose is going to shoot Poe with lowered agility. That's something. Here's hit, crit, crit. Oh. Oh. Never mind. Never mind. Going to shoot Poe with what now? Sorry. I didn't quite catch that last bit. Nothing. Into Ray. Range two. Out the back. Not range two. Oh, you're right, Daniel. Yep, I definitely forgot that part of Merle's ability. Gonna get his lock back and just leave it. Rose. Range two and array. Two dice. There are no other friendly ships in arc, so no rerolls. One hit. Stealth device ray. Ooh. Loses the stealth device. And that'll do it. Gee, gee. Thanks for playing, guys. I'll see you next episode. No, no, no. <laughs> Double evades. Nimi. Now, Nimi can change a result into a focus, I believe. Doesn't need to. Hit it, crit. It's not obstructed. Okay. Spin the force point, take one. Back to dials. You take the lock twice. Mm. Ray on Rose. Rose. 
Rolled three dice, re-rolled two, and got the lock back. No, it's only once, right? Luck was already um, there because we were taking it as an action in the first place. I don't remember she had it before she shot. Uh, do you want to jump in? or? I'll just make sure with Maui. I mean, if... If he didn't do it with the attack, then he would have just done it with the defense against Rose, so. I'll not double check. Ah, oh, true. I mean, they're saying, you, you know, when he gets shot, you can just disperse a, a blank and just uh, use that instead. So nothing really changes it. Yeah, okay. Yeah, once per opportunity. Cool. Clear it up with Ollie. Hey, just double checking. Hey, the, the ray lock. Did you the, shoot? So I tried to say hmm, <laughs> and something flashed. I I didn't see it, but yeah, it wasn't it wasn't intentional. Uh, my intention was to rotate my arc, but oh, so I'm, I'm talking about the the rose ray lock. The what about? Oh yeah, so. Uh, have we we've paused it. one second. We'll just pause the clock. Um, so what happened is I rolled three dice. Mm -hmm. I used Rose Tico mm -hmm. um, to get a target lock. Oh, uh, it depends on your definition of spend one of my results. So I used Rose Tico to get a target lock because mm -hmm. using the blank i rerolled the two eyeballs into two eyeballs i then spent rose again to get the lock back is that not something i'm allowed to do no so it's once per opportunity so once per that attack you can use rose gotcha so you couldn't reacquire gotcha. that's fine lock is lock is gone cool no worries there we go got that cleared up now what was he worried about with his arc I think he's mm. trying to figure out if he should boost. I don't know if Ho is like needs a runway to get to move out of the way. I don't think he's moving the So where's Po going? In? Oh, let's start the timer back. We're good. Yeah. Ah, I rotated the turret left. Okay. For Ray. Poe's coming in. Yeah, that's good. So, like, if 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 uh, Ray's going to get shot, then you want to might as well just uh, give her some options for them to shoot at. Rose has three hole. Ooh, Rose, advanced proton okay, like, torp. Let's do it. Oh, here we go. Max cottage. Didn't even need to lock. <laughs> Don't you dare re-roll those. <laughs> oh, boy. That is a dead rose. Po oh boy. GG. 
GG well played, Rose Tico. One hit and an eyeball. Spins the lock. Two hits. Poe, no. Defensive mods, takes two. Oh, yep. They move past Ray. Into Bastion. Hit crit. Spins the blank for a lock. Two evades. Nice. Bastion. Got range three into Poe or Ray. Both are two shields down. Probably easier to hit Ray, although she has force points. Poe's got no mods. Gonna go on Poe. Spin that focus. Three hits, Poe. No defensive mods. Poe taking one. Shields down. Oh, man. He almost lost 41 points there. That was worth it, though. Man, that was a little bit of a dive there from Poe. Takes out... Rose does take some damage on himself, but uh, doesn't end up giving up points. Do you do a one bank repo, or are you worried Nimi's going to charge straight through that debris trying to stop you? Mm. I think I think Nimi will try that. So see if you got to got to bounce it out. How's Bastion? Bastion's lost two shields. So there's nobody in danger of being... Nobody super close to dying. Uh, with Concentrated Fire, you could probably get Bastion out of there. Um, Kaz is turning left. Nimi probably coming over the debris, like you said. So where can they not capitalize. Do you go left around the debris or right with Bo? Oh. I mean, a, a left one bank? Um, how does that get blocked? Uh, by Nimi doing a three bank over the top. So Nimi blocks with a three bank. Poe bumps into that. Kaz... I'll do a free forward. Clear the stress you have, gain the stress on the debris, uh, but you'll be, you know, your front won't be overlapping that. No one will have guns on you next time you run. Raise too far out for all three ships to converge. So you might be able to get like a 1v1. Ooh, look at this. Turning towards Ray. Kaz with the Talon. Ooh. Two bank from Ray. It's not going to be 
obstructed, is it? Goes for the boost. Already has a lock there on Bastion. Alright, which way did Poe choose? Well, now if he did the 3 4, he would just bump into Nimi and get shot by Kaz. Ooh, one straight. He can Pover drive here. Focus. Don't say that again. You don't like it? I've had enough of your, <laughs> your dad joke. Stop it. I didn't make that. I just adopted it. Uh, focus. Roll right. It put you in two arcs. Could you roll left and do the T-Bank boost around the side? Oh, Yes. Is it going to overshoot? It looks close, doesn't it? Yeah, I mean, that looks better. He's making sure he's going to get the better lineup. He's getting out of there. Oh, never mind. Ray on Bastion. Range two. Ray, range two. Uh, 3v2. I don't like that from Poe, to be honest, because now... Ray's isolated and Poe can't really get back into it without going over that debris. And she's in a corner, like there's not not a lot of choices next turn. Spins the lock on the focuses. Crit crit. Bastion has a shield, would like one of eight in here. Negative. Wounded pilot. Range three. This is Nimi, who does have the focus. Man, never going to see Nimi's ability. Three hits. One of eight takes two. All right, Bastion. Double modded shot into Ray. Yes, there it is. Gonna take two at least and give up half. One, two, three. And look at that. Starvald on the board. 50 points. Narrows Ollie's lead down to 34. And like you said, I mean, we have Ray's out here on her own. Bastion didn't even have to spend his lock. Well, he reacquires it anyway with his ability. Um, there's only one stress on Ray, so she can still do a hard to boost out. So really need to get prepared for that eventuality. Hard two from Bastion. Hard two fits, doesn't it? On the free hard for Ray, for Bastion, Bastion. Uh, two hard fits. Does it hit the debris? I would one hundred percent be up for blocking Ray just for giggles. How do you? How? Wait. 
that blocks her too hard. Uh, yeah. You say you would, yeah. Because now she can do a two turn and boost, but uh, uh, Bastion still probably has you and Ark. Fine, play the safe way. He's down to three heart, uh, three hull, so. I mean, Ray could just kill him right now. 4v2. Oh, he does the focus. Barrel roll. I guess the wings are closed. Here's Nimi. Take that focus. Kaz, one bank focus. Three hard from Ray. Might as well go big. And there's no amount of dodging, right? You just need to kill Bastion. Yeah. Thing is, with all this rotating and boosting and whatnot, you can't take focus tokens. He's had oh. a couple of he's had a couple of good shots, but because of the eyeballs, he can't do anything yeah. about it. Yeah. He doesn't want to spend his force uh, too much. Too hard from Poe. Do you want to reacquire lock, maybe? No, I just boost and sit there. You don't want to stress yourself out here. Actually, no, yeah, because you got two turned, don't you? Yep. There it is. All right. Range one into Bastion 4v2. Target lock, force points. Bastion's on three. Target lock. Oh, there's no crits oh, in there. Good. It's going to make it a little harder. Bastion. One evade takes three and dies. Wow, that's big. That is big indeed. Now, Nimi's ability when attacking people... Defender's initiative is higher than yours, which it is. You can change a blank into a focus, which she will. Yeah. Three hits. So taking two at least. Takes two. Down to two on Ray. And Ray's alive. That she is. Yeah, now, Nimi... Uh, Nimi's full health. But now you gotta try and catch Ray, who's got the whole board open to her now. Is it the three? No, the... Okay, the two is the fastest blue, but you can... You can do a white maneuver and still boost. Do a three forward boost if you want. Oh, man. Kaz and Nimi. Uh, let's see. So it's a 57-point lead for Ollie. The rest of Ray gets you 50. Yep. Selbert seen in the chat. Needs to half po too. Oh, we had a disconnect from Ollie. Give him a second to get back. Six minutes. Bring Kaz and Nimi in on Ray. Do you... Oh, man. Would you like hard to Nimi and hope that Ray goes fast? You tell him on Nimi and try to have yeah. Kaz finish. I'd also bring Kaz in for sure as well. Yeah. 
No doubt. He hasn't been damaged, has he? Kaz? Nah. Yeah. He can't he can't slam to get the extra distance. True. I mean from there you could have done like a free forward, free turn, and then whichever way whichever place Ray goes is she's getting shot. And Poe, too hard in. And deep about feelings. Thinking about where that extra it, that Poe overdrive booster barrel roll goes. It doesn't matter <laughs> if it doesn't. I mean, like when you don't have options like that, you have to try and gauge, you know, like where these ships are going to go. But when it comes to uh, ships with like Poe and the overdrive thing, it's just like you just you just turn in and then you will have a target after you've done your things. It's, it's kind of similar to uh, supernatural reflexes. I will dial in a hard three and then I'll make it up as I go along. Then hit a rock and lose the game in 10 minutes. <laughs> yeah, people asking about why the timer has stopped. Uh, Ollie disconnected, so we're letting him come back. How's it going? Uh, yeah, computer crashed. <laughs> oh, that's Sorry. rude. Well, that's fine. We can uh, we can the wait. Sip on some beverages. The timer was on seven minutes fifteen, I think, or something like that when I left. Uh, uh, Starbolt stopped it. Oh, perfect, perfect. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, it just decided to completely explode on me. Uh, it's hex lowercase, right? Yep. There we go. There you are. All Oof. right, let me promote. Yeah, and you're good. Cool. There he is. Blue screen, wow. Yeah, the Wi-Fi is different in the UK. Like, you have to plug it into either the computer or the wall or your uh, kettle. There's, you, you can't do it <laughs> both kettle? at the same time. <laughs> All right. Beautiful. It's a mod mirror, my good man. You, you can heat up water with internet. Mm -hmm. You guys have really got it figured out over there. Every time I see your name pop up in as white player, I always it, like, it takes a nerve. Wow. Because I'm just like, what? No, 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 no. I'm just like, what, what? What have I done? What have I done? <laughs> and 90% of the time, it is me cleaning up after you because you refuse to throw your dice away. I was going to reuse them. Like, <laughs> I like those dice. Over there? All right. Nemi really commits to the... Ooh, look at that. Well, actually, Ray won't be able to shoot anything, but that's not terrible. Two bank from Poe. Bank left. Wow. Oh, he's playing some keep away. Oh. If Ray dies, is, po is Ollie still ahead on points? Yes. Okay. Yeah, you gotta kill Ray and get half on Poe. Poe's one away, but you gotta catch him. Crit goes through, hull breach. Alexa, play the Benny Hill theme. <laughs> oh boy, triggered. Four, five, six, seven. Yep. All right. So yeah, now well, you can get five minutes, maybe two rounds. Seemed weird it didn't go for a shot on Kaz. Because that was a safe, that was a safe bet. Oh, for Poe? Yeah. Yeah, I like just take a snipe shot. If you do well, then you just fin you know run in, finish the job before time runs out. So even if you take off, then you still have.
Nimmy, getting out in front. Uh oh. Uh. Well, I guess he's got to shoot two ships. I mean, I mean, yeah, I mean, iron up the two bank with Ray. I think that's probably where my head would go to. Oh, there okay. Kick a cold it. Yep. All right, three minutes. You got to finish this turn fast. I mean, the nice thing is Poe's heading into a corner. So if there was ever a time where you're pretty sure you know where Poe's going to end up, it's next turn. Uh, getting over there, different story. But uh, Poe, uh, Ray going to shoot into Kaz. Range one, side arc. Takes crit, crit crit. Direct hit. Not too bad. That is half point structural damage. Alright, back into Ray. Well, I was just talking about earlier, why didn't I just throw Ooh, something out? Right back at you. Sorry. Hit, hit, crit, crit. She's dead. Cass would be dead at that point. One more turn. Ollie in the lead by 29. Now there is damage card. There are damage cards to expose on Kaz. If you want to slam, if you feel like you need to slam to get Ark. Uh, still going to be really tough with a um, a Poe that can boost in barrel roll and two speed booster barrel roll. So it feels like you need to have somebody go in close and somebody hang back. Oof. Yeah, I mean, Poe does a one bank. If Kaz approaches, Kaz is dead. Nimi's too far out. Oh, Nimi moves first too. Yeah, Starfall knows he's gonna he's gonna hold up for a turn. Oh, he he repairs with R five. So the crazy thing is, he is now seven points away. But there is oh, you know what? There's a minute left. If Poe doesn't engage, there's another turn. Rolls left. Yeah, so there shouldn't be any shot there. All right. We get another turn. 43 seconds left. Now, Nimi is staring at debris. Uh, I don't think she's going to care. I think she's going to hop right over that. Uh, so Kaz, slam left, bug out. Nimi jumps over the debris, takes a pot shot. Why wouldn't you bring Kaz in? Because Kaz will die. If you lose Kaz and do half on... Oh, yeah, you're down by 51. Yeah. But if Nimi approaches Poe, Poe might not be able to half Nimi, but if Nimi can half Poe with some, some lucky dice... That'll be it, right? Yeah. Quick maths from Death Quick Lane. Math. For once. Alex is going to take his time here. I've just checked the rules. You are allowed to stall on the final time when the time has been called anyway, so it doesn't matter. Stall. Oh, boy. When thinking <laughs> is called stalling. Wow, 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 wow. Triggered. 
I also like to remind my opponents I'm not stalling, I'm just fig. <laughs> I'll say two C's. Mm. I saw that fire cast. Rocky Crocker records that. <laughs> All right. That's the nicest thing anyone said to me all year. To be honest. <laughs> all year, all of twenty twenty one. Oh yeah. Oh, uh, last year as well. Okay. Quite a year. Quite a, yeah. Well then. All right, we got a maneuver for Poe. I think Poe's got the right to get out of it. Oh, I'm looking the wrong down. We got a maneuver for Nini. Rethinking it. You have to, you have to bank right over the debris. I mean, it it, it just it just seems like a bait as well. Where I mean, for the last few turns, Poe's trying to run away, and then on the last turn, he's just got the magic. He'll just jump in out of nowhere and snipe someone. Yeah. All right, here we go. Three bank across the debris. Oh, two I don't bank. Like that, <laughs> I definitely don't like that. A two bank would have been nice, I think. Three bank too far to the right. Yeah, there's a big open space between those two ships. Yeah, Nobody like, is blocked. Oh. Uh, ooh, what's that? He is. Oh, he can just uh he can just barrel roll left and he's done. Can he fit left? Even with a one? Yeah. Well he doesn't have to, Sus. right? He can just do uh, what do you call it, focus and then two boost. Either way, this is this is done. You heard it here, folks. It's done. Nimi's got a shot. No, no, she doesn't. Okay. Nimi does not have a shot. You heard it here from me first. Uh, Death Rain is <laughs> disconnected the from the Discord. Uh, <laughs> and there you go. GG in the chat. Congratulations me. to Ollie winning by seven points. 107 to 100. Starvald is secure in his... Uh, uh, going into the cut, and I think we'll have to hear from Rookie, but I think that puts Ollie in. Um, but congratulations to Ollie for the win here today. Death Rain, thank you for being here. You're welcome, Scott. Thanks, everybody, for watching. That'll do it for this match. Until next time, this is Scott from Hexiled Gaming, signing off.